dear students today we discuss on the subject an art of writing examination examination is an inevitable part of school life it is an assessment of personality development every exam is a brain work within a limited period of time test is an in evaluation on the mental capacity and memory power of the examinee the success or failure of examination depends upon the performance of a student examinations are mainly of three types oral practical theoretical oral examination is a personal interview of checking the conceptual development of a pupil practical examinations are based on experimental method and held in a laboratory or a workshop theoretical examinations are produced in answer sheets many students fear exam fear creates a lot of worries it develops psychological symptoms like exam fever headache stomach ache etc but there is no need for fear for the students who follow the art of examination methodology take deep breath and relax avoid all forms of tensions there are two aspects for any exam preparation and appearing preparation there are two types of preparation remote and proximate a clever student is a regular in study remote preparation is a systematic study done daily a student prepares brief notes and keeps it for the examination the best time to study is the holy hours from 5 am to 8 am and 5 pm to 8 pm in which the memory is sharp before going to bed try to memorize the portion of the day immediate preparation is the urgent study in the examination days don't burn the midnight oil have a sound sleep in the previous night commit to memory the formulas poems and theorems at the peak hours once by heart it try to forget the matter knowingly and then recall it some tips for preparation properly budget your time make a time table on the base of your syllabus and time at hand give more time to the subjects you are not sufficiently confident cover the whole course don't leave the out the lessons or units and know something about everything but be selective on important ones revise this is the most important thing whatever you study in a day be sure to revise that again the next day and sometime during the next week Don't try to break new ground just before the exam. Only revise what you already know. Some tips for appearing. Take with you the hall ticket or test admitting card. Reach the exam hall bell in time with at least 15 minutes to prepare. Don't try to swallow up the answer at the last minute. Make certain that you carry an extra pen and necessary materials like pencil, rubber and instrument box etc. Make a, pray- a prayer just before you begin to write the exam and that will lead you to concentration. Write the roll number or name etc in the appropriate place. Read and understand the questions carefully before you begin to answer and make particular note on the special instructions given have a wrist watch to arrange and calculate the time allowed to answer each question first impression is the best impression answer the questions you know best first then the ones last you are unsure about put margin sufficiently on the sides and write the questions numbers exactly Your handwriting should be neat, tidy and legible. The overall appearance of the answer paper must be neat. 
be careful about grammar spelling and punctuation answer to the points avoid unnecessary cancellations overwriting and repetitions after completion go through the answer sheet once and correct the mistakes and ensure that the question numbers are put exactly tie the papers with a knot and submit to the examiner or invigilator no matter how much you muck up what you really matter is how much concentration you have and how organized you are the success of any exam depends upon planning concentration hard work and ability to express it is within the reach of a well prepared student to score first rank wish you all the best and good luck thank you